दोस्तों हम एस को बहुत टफ मानते हैं उस कि मतलब लोगों की अपने खुद के कुछ ओपिनियन होते हैं कि भैया ये बहुत टफ है क्यों है क्या नहीं है ऐसा देखिए कुछ भी नहीं है आपको कुछ बेसिक चीजों के लिए इवेल्युएट किया जाता है जो आपके खुद की पर्सनालिटी है द वे यू आर द वे यू बिहेव द वे यू एडजस्ट यू नो वी आर टॉक अबाउट ऑयल क्यूज एंड एवरीथिंग ऑफ सर लाइक क्वालिटी ऑल दिस थिंग्स बट उसके पहले देयर इज अ प्राइमरी रिक्वायरमेंट व्हिच इज नॉट अंडरस्टूड बाय मेनी एंड दैट इज द डिफरेंस व्हिच टेक्स यू यू नो आउट ऑफ द गेम और व्हिच मेक्स यू द विनर सो हाय गाइस बिफोर स्टार्टिंग लेट मी टेल यू अबाउट माय सेल्फ हाय गाइस माय नेम इज अमित मलिक एंड आई एम एन एफोर्स पायलट एंड आई विल टेल यू अबाउट थ्री फोर पॉइंट्स एंड वेरी बेसिक पॉइंट्स प्लीज ट्राई एंड अप्लाई इट एंड यू विल डेफिनेटली क्रैक योर एसएसबी reason being we know everything and once we know everything there is no more scope of learning so guys uh, let's start but watch this video till the end do like and subscribe so that you know what you have to do and tell to others also who are not following it so guys let's come to part 1 so guys first point which i would say is unlearn by unlearn guys unlearning is also a kind of learning because what happens is we watch all these videos uh, we go through so many books we know what is going to happen so we already have made a image in our mind once you already have a image you are not giving you a hundred percent as per that situation because what you do is you start thinking as per the situation or what you have read why you are doing that situation can be different first of all forget this unlearning is only for the part for the initial stage once you start doing it forget that part whatever has happened that is gone okay or i would say that you have learned that is a separate thing all together keep it aside once you are there just listen and see what is happening go as per that situation not whatever the situation is there in your mind because how things are associated i'll tell you now see come to point number 2 listen to instructor now you guys have been reading a lot you guys must have taken coaching or you guys must have discussed things amongst uh, yourself so what does happen is you don't listen to instructor it's like you know what is going to happen if you know what is going to happen then you will not listen to instructor if you will not listen to him you will lose out okay and because you already had the thing in your mind so that's why you are not listening to the instructor third point listen to instructions because as we all already know the process so we don't listen to the instructions so guys you lose out there because you think every time it's going to be you know same thing why do you think it's going to be the same thing things can change you know it can be a different pattern it can be something like a new study which can be applied they want people to understand in a different way because daily the world is changing scenarios are changing our habits nature you know focus everything changes so that's why it's quite possible that thing might also change whatever was asked to here today situation might be different they might you know would like to know something else but as you know that okay after pptt this thing will happen i have to go for the discussion test here i have to just tell whatever i have to tell you know that my story so what happens is you are not listening here they might be asking for something else you are not listening to that so your mind setup is there you or maybe you are trying to listen but your focus is on the other side because you are not leaving this part behind you are not leaving it so once we are coming to this instructions you are losing out on the part so you listen half half goes to your mind and the way you interpret it god knows how you are going to interpret it so you lost out on most of the like you know most of the important thing or i would say the main important thing is instruction fourth clear your mind
focus why think take time for 10 seconds 15 seconds and you will realize why i'm talking about this because our mind is filled with thoughts it's filled with whatever you know it's been taught to us so we come to any situation we assess it with our previous thought we are not you know uh, the ssb wants to judge you the way you are not what has you know it like somebody made you learn that thing so they want like you know raw capability how you think if you are like a normal person how many times you think the guys who you know take coaching and all and then they go how many of them selected hardly we'll see a person or two or three maybe why because they are not clearing their mind and the guys who actually do clear it they keep things in mind but they keep it aside first of all they assess the situation they clear their mind they assess the current situation what the current situation is how you have to react to a situation at present if you will not react to the situation which is right there in front of you and you have something else going on in your mind so how will we be able to do justice with the task which is at hand you will not be able to do so that's the main reason see four points nothing you know out of the blue which i have told you these are very common points but how many of you do actually apply it and then you start doing it because see it's something like i'll tell you it's about 12th board or any other exam we know in board okay it's two and a half hours time or three hours time i have to finish off my paper maximum thing is you know in question any question or is given how many times do we read the instructions the still thing is it is written but here somebody is explaining you and that is the instructor if you will look at this person you might be able to make out you know what kind of mood that person is having what kind uh, of personality that person is having you can very well try and you know learn something from that person the way uh, he comes up the first time you interact with this guy or he gives about you know his intro or whatever so there are so many things to learn but thing is there we go and our only focus is like it's ssb 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 guys you have to clear it that is okay for that you have to clear your mind your focus your focus will take you through your clarity in thoughts your clarity uh, you know in assessing the situation will help you out to do that because once you are focused and you have that clarity in mind definitely you will do better than what you have something like what you have in your mind because many times the situation changes and the expectation also changes maybe in a group people are different their thought process might be different but some of them are not able to make it or i would say how many of them are there who are able to make it so you have to make your own choice so guys i would say personally from my behalf you keep these points in your mind and uh, try and apply it before your ssb on small small things and see where do you stand if you will do them like you know practically apply them in your day to day life or i would say like uh, for any task then you will see that you will do much better than what is expected out of you or what you had in your mind so guys uh, that's it from my side stay tuned please watch like and subscribe and please tell to others so that uh, they also get benefited and try and apply it in a day to day life and especially part of ssb or any other process so for any process these things will help you out and you will be able to do much better so guys uh, stay connected take care bye bye and jai hind